Murray Shiskal, who has been my dear friend for over 30 years, uh, kicked off Tootsie with the thought of how would you be different if you had been born a woman? It was a, in a conversation we had one time. Not what does it feel like to be a woman, because all sexes have asked themselves the question, what does it feel like to be, what would it feel like to be the opposite sex? But the, his question was different. If you, if you were born a woman, how would you be different? So that kicked off, which is a, it would take too long to answer how we then got involved in Tootsie for, for about two years before we even got a director, just working on different drafts of the script. But I did go to Columbia and I asked them if they would spend the money to do makeup tests so that I could look like a woman. And if I couldn't look like a woman, they would agree not to make the movie. And they said, what do you mean? And I just somehow intuitively felt that unless I could walk down the streets of New York and not have dressed as a woman and not have people turn and say, who's that guy in drag? Or turn for any reason, that you know, who's that freak? Unless I could do that, I didn't want to make the film. I didn't want the audience to suspend their, 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 their believability. When we got to that point, and looked at it on screen, I was shocked that I wasn't more attractive. And uh, I said, now you have me looking like a woman, now make me a beautiful woman. Because I thought I should be beautiful. I, if I was going to be a woman, I would want to be as beautiful as possible. And they said to me, that's as good as it gets. Uh, that's as, as beautiful as we can get you, <laughs> Charlie. <laughs> And it was at that moment that I had a, an epiphany, and I went home and started crying, uh, talking to my wife. And I said, I have to make this picture. And she said, why? And I said, because I think I'm an interesting woman when I look at myself on screen. And I know that if I met myself at a party, I would never talk to her, that character because she doesn't fulfill physically the demands that we're brought up to think we have women have to have in order for us to ask them out. She says, what are you saying? And I said, there's a, too many interesting women. I have, I, have, I, I have not had the experience to know in this life because I have been brainwashed. And That was never a comedy for me.